These are three profitable tree species for riparian buffers in well-drained or mostly dry soil. We'll go in order of increasing management requirements. The first is black locust, grown for fence posts and rot-resistant lumber. It's also phenomenal for cattle producers looking to grow their own fence posts and have silvopasture paddocks for livestock shade. Black locust takes about 10 years to produce fence posts, and the next species, Chinese chestnut, takes five to eight to nine years to produce high quality, amazing chestnuts. If you're someone that wants to harvest and market nuts a lot like pecans, Chinese chestnuts cater to a supply that is insufficient and a demand that is significant. They do well in well-drained acidic soils and you'll want to plant them at least 20 feet from the ditch so you're not harvesting nuts in an inaccessible incline. Number three is elderberry. This native shrub produces purple berries that alleviate cold and flu symptoms, especially when combined with black currant. This one is good for smaller farms that work with their hands because I've found that large commercial cattle and grain producers aren't super interested in hand harvesting berries. The great news is that you can combine all of these tree species with each other and with other tree species. And with that, we can steward habitat, water quality, and farmland.